Hey everyone, how's it going today? This is Crypto Foxy. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. So in this video, we're going to talk about a few cryptocurrencies that are on my list and ones that I think are ready to explode. So uh, I do have an article for you guys. However, um, this article covers a few cryptocurrencies that I am extremely bullish on. So I thought it was perfect to uh, to talk about today. Before we get into it, though, smash the like button on this video and subscribe to my channel for more cryptocurrency news and information and stuff. Um, I come to you every single day with different videos and uh, I cover a few different cryptocurrencies quite regularly. And uh, so these are a few that are on my list. So the current bearish market where many cryptos are experiencing a decline in value becomes imperative for investors to analyze and pinpoint tokens that demonstrate resilience and positive momentum, which is exactly what I like to do on my channel. So therefore, this article helps uh, investors identify digital assets with growth potential. So we're going to look at the first one being HBAR. So Hedera's HBAR, between January 11th and February 5th, the native token of Hedera blockchain witnessed a significant 22% decline. However, the market momentum shifted to a bullish stance following an announcement of Hedera's partnership with the Saudi Arabian government on February the 6th. Um, so this partnership is allowing companies to develop advanced technological solutions at the newly established Deep Tech Venture Studio. The HBAR price surged by 15%, soaring from 6.9 cents to 7.7 .7 within 24 hours of the partnership announcement, as illustrated in the chart above. Um, so Hedera had just announced its participation in the upcoming ETH Denver event, which is awesome, scheduled for later this month. So they did participate in the WEF conference that was held, um, I believe it was last month. And um, so now they're heading to ETH Denver. So they are doing their networking. I think it's amazing. Um, so in Denver, they're going to be participating with other prominent Web3 projects and protocols at the Ethereum Denver Build Mountain Cafe. So awesome. So they're going to be basically talking, uh, uh, exchanging ideas and insights and uh, talking with other blockchain enthusiasts there. So that is fantastic. So Lido Dow is another one on my list. Uh, decentralized. I haven't done many videos on Lido Dow if I have at all, but it is in my portfolio. Um, it's It's been doing fantastic uh, over the last, I think I've had it for over the last year and a half, maybe. Decentralized organization that has uh, that offers staking infrastructure for various blockchain networks mainly provides liquid staking solution for Ethereum. So when you stake your Ethereum on Lido Dow, it basically gives you um, Lido staked ETH uh, ST ETH token in return. So then you can take your token and go back to their platform and exchange it for your ETH back once you're done with your staking. So it's kind of nice because then you can still track your Ethereum in your wallet because it doesn't just disappear like it's like a lot of staking does, right? So Lido Dow shares it's on its social handle that 25% of the ETH supply is currently staked. Moreover, the token announced that Lido Finance V2, a core part of uh, liquid staking, introduces a new hub and spoke architecture. However, this is designed to guarantee permissionless and decentralized staking. So this is really good. Um, they, they've been working very, very hard. So the trend remains neutral on Lido Dow, suggesting the potential surge in the token's value with exceptions of retesting, with expectations, sorry, of retesting the $4 high shortly. So that's one I would definitely uh, take uh, notice on as well. Um, Crow. So Crow, Kronos Coin, uh, primary token for the Crypto.com blockchain. Over 350,000 individuals have used Crow for transactions in the three months since its launch, with more than which is more than what was expected. So Crow's daily price movement chart reveals a decline of bullish momentum following a recent bearish rally. Prevailing, prevailing market conditions favor the bears who have capitalized on this opportunity to se secure quick gains. So this could be an opportunity because uh, if you followed the last... Um, the last bull market, we noticed that Crow actually did exceptionally well during the uh, the bull market. So this is one that I continue to hold on in my portfolio. I'm also staking it, so I can't really take it out because I am using their um, their Visa card and I get more rewards and such. So um, Crow recently announced its collaboration with Orbi Network on its social media platform. This is new. Uh, it's now part of the Kronos Accelerator Program's cohort. It in introduces a new concept to the Kronos DeFi space, interest-free borrowing of its state stablecoin USC. So that's something that um, Crow has coming up that is a definite uh, catalyst for them. Um, so all three of these tokens I really, really like. And uh, I just wanted to bring you this guys this article. Obviously, none of this is financial advice whatsoever. You do what's right for you for sure. However, these are ones that I am currently watching and I just wanted to let you guys know. That's what I got for you in this video. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll catch you in the next one.